So why hash? I felt like every community I've ever been a part of, I was always a visitor. But hash feels like home. We're all into something that we've met at least a few people that didn't like us for being into it. We've had to convince others that we're not bad people for doing this. When you talk to people in the hash community, they are obsessed. And usually it's about cannabis, but not always. Food, fashion, music, they're just into things. When you fall into this community, you're not just falling into a place that is in love with hash. They are lovers. They love everything. And that's my favorite part about it, is that once you're in here, it's easy to find other things that are as rewarding as hash has been in your life. So much that goes behind the scenes in that one jar, it's all out of love. Cultivation is the most important aspect of it. Finding new cultivars and new flavors, like that's invigorating to me. Our whole history on agriculture, it's connected to cannabis. It's just the fashion. It's, we follow the terps. Ice water extraction. It's this almost brand new artisanal process. It's a really beautiful thing to witness. And once I started honing in my craft, you know, I just judged it based off of the hashes that I was going out of my way to purchase as a consumer because I came from this as just a hash lover. We want to consume something that makes us go wow. There's nothing like hash on flavor. Flavor Same. is the chase. There's no like food on the planet that a lot of these dabs have the terpene profiles of that you're getting inside your mouth. Like I don't find fruits that I can do that from. This is just starting to blossom and it's only getting bigger and only getting larger. There's so much more that's gonna be coming. To me, the most exciting thing about the future of cannabis, the potential of the cannabis space is safety. It just means that we can travel the world and consume cannabis and not be afraid of losing our lives for our love to this plant. That to me is the greatest hope above all else. Just the thought that maybe one day you could go to a country like Singapore and you could consume and not lose your freedom from it. That to me is the most exciting part of our future. If that's what we're running towards, what a great thing we have done as a collective. Everyone, everyone who's ever touched the plant and advocated for it, what a great thing if it means that one day we have no fear about losing our lives for this thing we love. And the story isn't over because there are still people in jail today and there are still people literally being killed for cannabis today. But we're starting to feel safe. And I, I had no idea this is where we would end up. And I am so grateful that I've been taken on this journey.